Hello, this is Miss Ashley at San Marcos Public Library, and today I have a very special kind of puppet show for you. In this puppet show, all the puppets are shadows, and they are going to tell you a story that might be familiar to you, but they're going to tell it in a new way. So I hope you enjoy this shadow puppet story called The Little Red Hen. The Little Red Hen once upon a time, there lived a little red hen. One day, when she was pecking in the dirt, looking for things to eat, she found some tiny seeds of wheat. Now, the little red hen could have eaten those seeds of wheat right up, but instead she thought and decided to plant the wheat and grow it into more wheat. So she said to the other animals, Who will help me plant this wheat? Not I, said the pig. Not I, said the duck. Not I, said the cat. Then I will plant the wheat myself, said the little red hen. And so she did. She dug a hole in the ground and she planted the seeds of wheat. And then she watered them. And after a while, the seeds grew into plants. And the little red hen asked, Who will help me tend these plants? Not I, said the pig. Not I, said the duck. Not I, said the cat. Well, then I will take care of this wheat myself, said the little red hen. And that's what she did. She pulled up weeds and she watered the plants every day. And eventually the plants grew into tall stalks of wheat with lots of wheat seeds at the very top. And the little red hen asked, who will help me cut this wheat? Not I, said the pig. Not I, said the duck. Not I, said the cat. Well, said the little red hen, then I will cut the wheat myself. And she did. Snick, 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 snick. Then the little red hen asked, Who will help me take this wheat to the mill to be ground into flour? Not I, said the pig. Not I, said the duck. Not I, said the cat. Then I will take the wheat to the mill myself, said the little red hen. And that's what she did. She took the wheat to the mill, and when it had been made into flour, she brought the flour back home. Then the little red hen asked, Who will help me make this flour into bread? Not I, said the pig. Not I, said the duck. Not I, said the cat. Then I will make the bread myself, said the little red hen. And she did. She took the flour and put it into a bowl and mixed and mixed and mixed. And then she formed the bread into a loaf and put it in the oven. Before long, it came out of the oven and it was a beautiful, delicious looking and delicious smelling loaf of golden bread. Who will help me eat this bread? said the little red hen. I will, said the pig. I will, said the duck. I will, said the cat. And the little red hen said, Oh, no, you won't. You did not help me plant the wheat or tend the wheat plants. You didn't help me cut the wheat or take it to the mill. You didn't help me... Mix the flour into bread, 
and you will not help me eat it. I will eat it all myself. And that is just what she did. Um, nom, 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 and it was delicious. And that's the end.